What's hatching YouTube? Back again with another video. I am Catch Me Shiny with Pokemon Go. So today we're doing Scatterbug. If you guys saw my previous glitch video, there's a way to get extra candy. So I hope you took advantage of that. I hope you guys got lots of candy. I managed to get a couple hundred, three, four hundred. And we're gonna spend this video evolving. So I have a few saved up. I think there were seven or eight of them saved up. So here's me just catching those. And we'll talk about Scatterbug and the difficulties you guys may or may not be having getting them. So, obviously we have to collect them by pinning gifts and getting gifts. And it is difficult to find friends from these regions, but they are out there. There's many of Discord groups, there's Facebook pages. All you gotta do is go in, search Pokemon, and uh, you should be able to find some. The trouble I had was I was already maxed out at 400 friends, so I had to delete a lot of them, make room, and now I'm able to get them left, right, and center. So here's just some more footage, me catching these guys, we'll collect them all, and then I plan to evolve several of them. I had one, evolved to the final form before this and I think they're kind of cute they're nice looking they're different so we're just gonna evolve a few I'll show you what they look like and then see which ones you guys have which ones you're struggling to find that's a good question how are you guys doing on them are you finding the people you need are you getting the areas are you close but not yet finished how is the scatterbug hunt going for you so We'll toss this ball, see what happens. They're pretty easy. Definitely want to be clicking on your pineapps, using your pineapps when you can. Also, if you notice, I have Beedrill as my Mega Evolve out. You want to get every opportunity to get as much candy for these as you can. So normally, if you don't use a pineapp, you get three. If you do pineapp, you get six. With the Mega, you get seven or eight. So you want to take advantage. Currently during the event that just ended, you were also getting extra XL candy for any of your great throws, your excellent throws, your nice throws. So while I was recording this, I was trying to maximize in every way I can. And then, like the last video on the Scatterbug Glitch showed, there was a way to pop in your buddy as a Scatterbug, walk it for a kilometer, and people were reporting that they got anywhere from 20 to 50 candy per kilometer. So it's still not patched as far as I know. If you hadn't heard about that glitch, go watch the other video on Scatterbug Glitch. See how you do it and go get yourself some candy. So here we are. They're all caught. I have the one that was evolved um, at 600 candy. So let's evolve a few and see what they look like. I haven't looked at what they look like. I've seen other people that have them as buddies, just different variations, but these will be all new to me as well. That's a pretty one. Very, very nice. Like the blue Tundra. What I did was I marked each scatter bug where, they're com where they come from so that I could keep track and not, mo um, not evolve the same one over and over again, wasting precious candy. So, next one up. Let's see what it looks like. Nice. Where's this one from? Sun region. You can Google also where the exact ones you're looking for are from, so you can go and look for those people in those areas specifically. But like I said, most of the Discord groups, most of the Facebook groups, whatever sources you have for Pokemon Go, most of them are already telling you, hey, I have such and such in my area, and they're looking for friends. Savannah, beautiful. So we got 300 candy more, so it looks like we're gonna do three or four more. And? Which one's this? Nice, brown, not as pretty as some of the others, but sandstorm, makes sense. So, obviously some will be nice, some won't be. None of them are useful. 
there's no purpose other than collecting them, getting them, evolving them. They're not going to be useful in any PvP or any kind of battling, definitely not in any raids. You might want to consider maxing one up some if you had 100%, but that's just for gloating. The river, very nice. I'm from the polar region, so we're skipping polar because I don't need to see that one. Everyone around here has it. So the next one up. What do we got? Ooh, nice. It's like a sunset, water and sun, ocean, go figure. All right, so like a water theme. I believe those are from like the Hawaii-ish region. Apparently I'm using some rare candy. Uh, I was one short. So monsoon is going to be our last one. I still have half a dozen to do. I'm going to save the candy, keep doing those friendships, and I will be doing my very best to evolve the rest of them. Once it's done, I think it's something that all of us will just move on from the game. I don't imagine people will be interested in continuously getting candy, but that one's nice. Look at that. Monsoon. Right on. So let's review them. Tundra, the sun. We got Savannah, Sandstorm, River, Ocean might be my favorite so far, and Monsoon, and then my original. Alright, so I got seven more to do. That's the video today, guys. I hope you had fun watching, and if you could, please go down below, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button make a comment, interact with the channel. I really like making these videos. I hope that somebody out there is enjoying them. I hope somebody out there is getting a little bit of something from them. And as always, have a great day and happy hatching.